Hey there, it's Robert with BudBells.com. And to start the workout um, with, you're gonna do four rounds. Um, it's good to do this with a uh, partner. So uh, as one partner is doing uh, one exercise, the other partner is doing the other. So you're gonna start out with uh, jumping lunge, 15 on each side, while your partner just squats and holds the squat. So a jumping lunge, you're gonna get into a lunge position, hop and switch. 15 on each side, while one person is doing that, the other person is down in, in their squat, not bottomed out and rounded out like, like this, all relaxed. Um, you wanna get into a nice strong st squat position and hold it, right? Working on using your hips, pull back your hip flexors, okay? So four rounds of that, jumping lunge, squat, uh, and that's one round, so you can do that four times. And then you're gonna do, um, the next one is 15 push-ups while the other one does, uh, the other person does a side plank, okay? So if you don't have a partner, you can just see how long it takes you to do either the jumping lunge or the push-ups and then do the active recovery or active rest um, for that amount of time. So 15 push-ups. Okay. While your partner is doing either a side plank on your uh, hand or side plank on the forearm. All right, four rounds of that. So the workout is you're gonna need three different size weights for the workout. A small one, a medium one, and a heavy one, or a light, medium, heavy. So the medium weight should be something that you use all the time, like uh, for swings, for snatches, for presses, you usually have a working weight that you use most of the time. So that's your medium weight. And you're gonna go one below it and one above it, okay? So the first one is swings. You're gonna start out, um, so I'm gonna start out with my right, then I'm gonna go to my left, then I'm gonna go to my right. So you're gonna go 10, 10, 10, right? 10 swings with the right, 10 swings with the left, medium weight, and then 10 swings with the right, heavy weight. Okay, after you do 10 with the heavy, go back to the beginning and switch hands. So now I'm gonna start with my left. I'm gonna go left, right, left. Left 10. Right. And then left. Okay, so that's the swing part. Then the cleans, you're gonna do the same thing, but you're gonna do 10, eight, six. So with the lighter weight, you're gonna do 10, medium weight, eight, and then six. Still alternating hands. 10, eight, and then six. Alternating back and forth. Okay. Um, then do it again, right? You're gonna go back through. So you're gonna switch hands. So then you're gonna do a goblet squat. So the same thing with goblet squat. Light 10, medium eight, heavy six. And you're gonna do that two rounds or, or two times through. Okay, so lightweight. <clears throat> Lightweight, you can really, you know, get down and pause for a second. Okay, really work on your form. As the weight gets heavier, of course, it's going to be harder to do perfect, but that's why you practice with the lightweight, and then by the time you get to the heavier weight, the your your perfect squats are just, you know, coming, right? They just happens. And then eight. And six. Okay, two rounds of that one. I'm gonna go through that twice, 10, eight, six with the squats. The last thing is snatches. So it, um, I, I put on there uh, two different options. You can either do uh, 10, eight, six, with uh, light, medium, heavy, or you can just do 10, 10, 10, all the way across. So if you can snatch your heavy weight for 10 reps, I would do 10 all the way across, so 10, 10, 10. 
Same alternating hands. Do the same thing. Light, medium, alternating hands. And heavy, alternating hands. Okay, 10, 8, 6. Or if you can do 10, 10, 10, that's recommended. All right, so there's your workout. Enjoy it, and we'll see you next time.